Hey there guys, so yeah, there's a really interesting fight coming up in about a week and a half between Virgil Ortiz and Amantas Stanionis. So, in my opinion, it's got the makings of a fight of the year contender, because both guys always come to fight, both guys are always in range, um, both guys have got very entertaining styles, um, and yeah, it should be a really good fight and a really entertaining fight. Um, and it's a fight I'm glad that's happening after it's been postponed a few times for various reasons. Um, so yeah, glad it's happening now. So. I favour Virgil Ortiz to win this fight, um, and I'll tell you why. So, Amantas Stanionis, he's got that sort of Liam Smith type fighting style, um, where he's always in the pocket, always looking to land shots on the inside, he's always in range. Um, and when his opponents throw a combination, or just a single shot, he always tucks up, stays in range. He's sort of like a punching bag when he tucks up. Um, he tucks up and sort of absorbs his opponent's shots before his opponent stops punching and he, and he fires back with his own shots. Um, sort of like an Arthur Abraham type fighter. Um, but he's quite basic to be honest. I think um, he hasn't really got that much power. His punching technique could be improved. Um, but yeah, he is tough and he's got good defense when he tucks up. Um, and he did look quite good against um, Bataev in his last fight. Um, I know the referee was a bit, you know, when Stanionis would hold. The ref would split them straight away instead of letting Butayev work on the inside. Um, but still, I thought Stanionis won the fight quite clearly. I thought he outworked Butayev um, in the fight. And um, yeah, he showed good stamina to go a hard pace for 12 rounds. Um, and I thought he won quite clearly, to be honest. So yeah, um, he's a good fighter, but he, he has got some improvements to make if he's going to be like a world level fighter. Um, and for me i think virgil ortiz just brings more to the table um he's got a lot of power he's obviously had 19 fights 19 wins um all 19 coming by stoppage um and none of his opponents have really been able to live with him so far um none of them have been able to cope with the power and the the pressure that he puts on um i mean look at his fights against um Kavalowskis and uh, michael mckinson um and his other fights like when he fought um you know his other, the other guys um they just haven't been able to live with his pressure or his power um and yeah i, th I think he's a he's a good fighter he's got a good guard he talks up really well um he blocks his opponent's shots well um and yeah he's, he's a guy who's improving fight by fight and um he looks like he's going to be a really good fighter in the future um, he's got a very stiff jab when he throws it. Um, obviously, he throws a power jab pretty much every time, um, and he should vary that because it, it comes becomes predictable what he's going to do. But yeah, he's got a very stiff jab when he throws it, um, and yeah, I, I just think he he brings more to the table than Stanionis. I think in a war, um, if they have a war, I think his power will tell, um, and I think he's he's got a better punching technique. Um, he'll be able to shorten his punch as well he'll be able to land um more frequently than stanionis i think stanionis is when he throws hooks he's quite wild with them um and he doesn't really hit that hard to be honest i, I, I just think ortiz will probably land more punches than him um and i think he might get the stoppage in this fight to be honest um i know stanionis is tough and he's got quite good defense but i think with his fighting style um standing in range all the time um i think Vir virgil ortiz will hurt him and um i think he'll probably stop him um yeah and well if the fight goes the distance i mean I th it's in ortiz's home state i believe um and it's on a golden by card so he will get the uh, the decision if it goes the distance um so yeah i favor virgil ortiz to win this fight and um yeah just a quick prediction for this for this fight I, I think it's quite a straightforward prediction um yeah but it should be an entertaining fight regardless so yeah thanks for watching guys and god bless